Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Alexa, and today we are going to be opening up our first eBay mystery box. Yes, I said it. eBay mystery box, and let's talk about it. So, this box costs $17, $18, somewhere around there. Um, I don't remember what is it the value of it was going to be, um, but it shipped out very quickly. Like I ordered it, and the same day I got a notification saying it shipped out. The only issue was not the, the person I bought it from, of course not, um, because they shipped it out quickly. It was actually USPS because they kept changing the delivery date, and they'll be like, yeah, it arrived that day. So it was mostly like USPS itself. It was like, oh, it's gonna arrive. Um, Friday Friday came and says arrives today and all this and then it wasn't like none of it was adding up to what it said it was so Monday came and it was like oh it's gonna arrive today it did arrive Monday but it arrived like like eight nine o'clock at night and I was just like USPS what is going on I think they're backed up honestly I just think that they're backed up because it's like okay anyways let's move on so when I received the box I was very very small so I don't know what's in it I paid 17 18 dollars for it um very nervous <laughs> because I'm afraid it won't add up to the value of it um obviously it's not gonna come with the cards so I will have to look up each individual price and like let you guys know on the screen somewhere blah 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 you know the good stuff so um it's rattly I hear that so let's open it up. Oh, goodness, I'm here. Oh, okay, it's very sticky. My finger got stuck to like the little sticky part here. Oh, it says thank you. Um, so let's open it up. Is it good stuff? Oh, okay, wait a minute. So, all right. Okay, so let's start with taking this out. Throw that away. Um, all right. So, it's not like she asked me any questions or anything. Like, she just shipped it out. Um, so, we have a hair. Oh, gross. Okay. I'm just going to put that in the box because I don't want to deal with that. And then we have this L'Oreal Cream Rich Lipstick. Two mini lipsticks. I don't know if you guys can see it. Um, I don't know if it's focusing on it. There's, like, too many lipsticks in it. Um, they're really pretty nudes. I'm not gonna use these at all um it's like very like it comes in like in a plastic container so it's like very pushed in like it's dented but that's not the reason I'm gonna use it the reason I'm not using it is because it looks like there's a hair oh <laughs> never mind the hair is on the outside of the packaging let's open it because I want to make sure it's fine Okay. So honestly, if the boxes, okay, I'm just gonna break into it with my scissors. If the boxes keep looking as like this, I don't think this would come with a value because I really think that this is something that you get like as a free sample or something. So yeah. So let's just open it. Ow. Okay. Ow, my finger got caught. Um, yeah, this looks like more of a free sample than it does as something you would buy. It does not have the colors on it. It just says, a la mauve perle. L'Oreal Cream Rich Lipstick, H331, H219. Um, they're very small. They're very, like, pinkish and, like, a very nudish one. So we're just going to put that to the side. And the next thing that we have here looks like it's a brow pencil um, or an eyeliner. Passport round trip eye definer. Um, well, it's sealed in here, so that's good. Let's see. Oh, off. Mm, round trip eye definer, San Francisco, London, uh, the Cape Town. And Stockholm. So these are two different eyeliners. 
one is in the shade Stockholm and one is in the shade Tape, shade Cape Town. So this one is Stockholm. I don't know if you guys can see it. Oh, um, that's not very, you know, out there. And then this one is Cape Town. Oh my gosh, I don't know how to. Like, so you're really bad at angling yourself here. And this is Cape Town. Um, honestly. I don't see a difference in the shades. I don't know if the camera's picking up a difference, but I don't see a difference and they look the same to me. So the next thing we have is this, it's still sealed because the sticky is like covering it. It is from Amuse Two-Way Lip Gloss Aloe Vera and Vitamin E. Okay, so I just broke the seal off of it. So it looks like it's Okay, so you know when you open up a brand new lip gloss or lipstick and when you open it, you can tell from the size whether or not it's been used or open. And it kind of gave it that look like it has been, so I'm not swatching that. Let's check the other side. Yeah, this side looks exactly the same way. I don't know if that's just how the product is or if it's been opened because it's very easy to like open it and like close it back up or make it look like it's never been opened so no next one we have is a Jordana eyeliner in the shade silver it's like a little baby mini eyeliner in silver so let's swatch that if you guys can see this one maybe I got my you cannot see it that well Probably not. Mm, I would. I, it looked brand new. It didn't look like it was touched or open, so that's good. Um, I really want to use silver eyeliners, but so far I have like two actual things that I would potentially keep and have to the side in my drawers. These other are the lipsticks that I'm not gonna. I'm just gonna throw them away. Um, so next we have. So this looks dusty. One two i don't know if the camera's picking up the dust or anything like that two there is no name of the product nothing like nothing um it does look like it has never been used but i don't know what this is it's just very dusty i feel like this has been lying around your house for a very long time waiting for someone to buy a mystery box and you just plop it in there no no thank you wouldn't use that either. Well, I mean, I would because there's nothing wrong with it. There's nothing tampered with it. It's just, I don't know what it is. All right, let's watch it. Okay, I think this is a brow pencil. It definitely looks like a brow, the way it broke off when I swatched it, it's a brow pencil. It's very, yeah, it's a brow pencil. It's waxy and everything. Um, I don't know. I don't even know what brand this is. So, I, I don't know. I don't know anything about that. Next one. We, okay, first of all, first the freaking all. This is a Lash Splash Cosmetics Waterproof Mascara. I need to get up because I'm going to show you how this looks. Because I don't think the camera's going to catch from up here. Let's look at this. Can you guys see this? This thing is... What the heck is going on here? Okay, it's sealed. So, obviously, it's not been touched or used or anything like that. But... Are you serious? And now this is reminding me of why I never got my three boxes off of eBay. But like, <laughs> okay, I would just like to point out that when you are packaging this, you telling me that you did not see this. You didn't see it. I want to show you again because I want you to see what I saw when I was unraveling it. Okay. Oh my god, this mask is going to get on my white sweater. So let's roll that side up. Look at this. You see it? Beautiful, right? What? What? You think I can get it out without making a mess? It won't even... Ugh. Oh, there we go. Okay, and the... Uh... <laughs> Spoolie's off and broken. That's fun. Um, so we all understand this is going in the garbage. Okay, next is a new 
smoothing eyeliner. Um, so one side is a smudger, which is a very weird texture of a smudger, right? Is it a smudger? It looks like a smudger, but it doesn't say anything else. And then this is the, oh my God, actual eyeliner part. Does it roll up or like, okay, so you see how low it is? Does it roll? Am I supposed to sharpen it? Um, I don't know. I don't know. See, she, no, I don't think she really knew who she was sending this stuff to because you gotta send stuff with instructions with me because I don't know what's going on. Is it rolling up or am I seeing things? No, I'm seeing things. What is going on? All right, let's swatch it. Okay, so it's a nice brown, but I don't know. Am I supposed to sharpen this? Okay, let's try using the smudgery part. Um, so it's just um looks like it's doing nothing, but making. Why does it look greasy now? Okay, you just, just no, no. Next thing we have here is Dati. Dati. That's all it says is Dati. If I'm even reading that right, if it focuses, it doesn't look like it's focusing. But that's what it is. And it is a lip gloss, I'm assuming, or glitter, or I don't know because it says literally nothing. Um, it does look like it has been opened before. Oh, it's a little liner. But if you look around here, around the rimming, it does look like it has been used and opened before. So, no. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, next thing we have here is sealed. So it's brand new. It's from Avon. It's the big color eye pencil crayon. Okay, so what she's doing is giving me a bunch of eyeliners. I mean, I can't really complain. Cause remember when I said I needed eyeliners? And she just heard my request. And she's like, here, eyeliners. Um, but the eye pencil crayon in natural vibe so does this okay so this is a sharpener too okay so it does have a, like a little tip but it's very small i'll run through that in two seconds so this is what it is it's like a natural vibe according to the shade it looks very like nudish um no i'm gonna hold on to it because you never know i might need something like a little natural vibe you know so i'm gonna hold on to it but i'm not excited for it Next thing we have is a NYX Made in USA lipstick in the shade Cito. Um, no, I refuse. I refuse. So it has like, it hasn't been used. I'm, I'm examining it. But if you look, I don't know if the camera's going to pick it up. There's like little sticky droplets on it i don't know if it's you can see if it's picking it up i don't know what's going on but no 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 i don't know what that is next we have another nameless it's like the brown one so we don't need to worry about that and then the last thing on this box not on the box in the box it was already it's not even sealed it's an eyeshadow in the shade 32A Sky Blue from Jordana. Jord Jordana Cosmetics. I don't know any of these brands other than NYX. Maybe the L'Oreal. Uh, Avon, I've heard of Avon. I never really used Avon, but I heard of Avon. Um, yeah, I don't know any of these things. But anyways, this is Jordana Cosmetics. Let me just examine this really quickly. Okay, so it hasn't been used. It hasn't been touched. Cool, cool, cool. So let's just swatch the sheesh. It's a very pretty blue color, honestly. Um, it's very pretty. Mm, it's very patchy. So it's very pretty in the pan. When you put it on, it looks more grayish than blue. Mm, it's, okay, so. So for $17, $18, I technically got a total of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 products. And that counted the two lippies, lippies together, not separate. That's 12 products for $17. Okay, that's not bad. The problem is, 
Some of them looked open. Not good. A um, lot of them look old. So, not good. Especially with this, this. I don't have everything in here. I'm like, okay, whatever. Yeah, no, I won't use it. I won't use this. Are you kidding me? This mascara? Are you kidding me? The thing is dry. You can see it from the packaging. It's a clear packaging. I understand if, like, the botella, like, the bottle of it was, like, black or something. You can't see inside of it and you didn't know if it was dry because it was sealed. Like, it was brand new sealed. But you can see it. So I don't understand where the confusion lies, sweetie. So, anyways, moving on. No, I mean, the little ones, okay, the little lippies, they were sealed. They were nice. They're pretty. I think I wouldn't really use them. There's nothing really wrong with them. There's no, like, used or anything. It's just, you know, small, simply sized things. There's nothing really wrong with it. Um, This one, I'm iffy on whether or not it was used or not because it does look like it's been open when I opened it and it's not okay. That's not okay. You don't send someone something that's really old like a freaking mascara or something that you've opened or maybe she used it. I don't know because it's been opened. I don't know. You know, it's like that thing like no this 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 no like I don't know what this I don't really oh, I can't tell let's focus on this again I want you to be able to see it I hope you can see it because it's it's a no it looks old like no you know it probably is old and then the liner which also looked like it was used and open from the corners of the sidings of the mm -mm, it's a no no but i did get some cool different eyeliners in here that you know are brand new and that i can use and play with because you know i always use eyeliner thank you guys so much for watching if you like this video make sure you give it a thumbs up and if you want to see more videos like this make sure you leave a little comment down below let me know what you want to see if you want me to do another ebay unboxing if you want me to get ripped off again um if <laughs> I mean, I can also do it on Amazon too. I tried looking on Amazon, but it was a little bit tougher because a lot of them were like brand companies and I wanted to do something more like a uh, random because if I do brand, it's going to be like only that brand makeup in it, like kind of thing. But if you want it, let me know. Let me know down below. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the little bell button down below so that you be notified every time that I upload. Thank you so, 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 so much for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Let me see a better group when the beat drops.